Well, season two of Invincible is right around the corner. And now we have an update on the live action movie from Robert Kirkman himself. So let's take a couple minutes to talk about what Kirkman had to say recently about the live action adaptation. Now, before we dive into it all, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for all the updates. Also, check out that merch shelf. It's a great way to support the channel. Well, we're all counting down the days to Invincible Season 2. The first season was an incredible adaptation of the first set of books, and I am absolutely, completely stoked for the upcoming series. Now, as many of you know, there is a live-action project in the works, and now it appears we finally have an update. Now, in case you didn't know, plans for the live-action Invincible movie were announced way back in 2017, with Seth Rogen and Evan Goldberg on board as writer and director, with Point Grey Pictures and Skybound Entertainment producing it for Universal. Now, right out of the gate, the project started moving really fast, so many of us were expecting this project to move really quickly. But then it seemed to fall on the wayside, with everybody paying pretty close attention to the animated version over on Prime, leading us to today, where everybody's talking about Season 2 of Invincible, but we have absolutely no news on the live action. Now, with Season 2 coming out, Kirkman is making the rounds, and recently he sat down with Variety to talk about the second season, and they actually asked him about the live action movie. This is what he had to say. The script is in the development stage. I think once we get the script to where it needs to be, I think we'll be in a good place and can finally move fairly quickly after that. But all of the factors that I just discussed are things that we're thinking about. How does this feel new? How does this feel different? How is it going to feel like something that's special? Those are all tall orders. We also need to find a way to play off the animated series but also differentiate ourselves and give the movie a reason for existing. There's a lot of work that needs to be done, but we're hopeful. Now, based on what Kirkman said here, I think he's becoming a victim of his own success. The animated Invincible series was a pretty faithful adaptation of the comics, and fans absolutely loved it. I think this sets a really high bar for a live-action project to try to surpass the animated series and bring us something new when the animated series did such a great job embodying the original series. Now, this doesn't mean it can't come up with anything new. It just means there's a really high threshold for success, and this will cause a studio to balk, sidelining projects in developmental hell. Now, obviously, Season 2 is just around the corner, and hopefully, after that, we'll start seeing some updates on the live-action film. Kirkman is saying the animated series should be between 18 and 16 months between seasons, so I don't think we're going to have a long wait next time. And I suspect if Season 2 is as great as Season 1, they may want to ride that wave into the live-action realm. But we'll have to wait and see.